I'm going to dive straight in with what I thought was the best part of Steve Jobs, and that was the script written by the gifted Aaron Sorkin. There is a stunning structure to the script that just sets an ideal pace for the film. It has three clear acts, and I couldn't help but think this film would play wonderfully as a stage play. The script is incredibly poetic, and you believe these people spoke these words. It is deserving of an Oscar for best screenplay. Danny Boyle proves himself again to be one of the best visual directors as this film is just stunning to watch. I was in awe over the fact that he made the decision to film in 16mm, 35 and then digital to show the advancement of technology over the 16 years depicted in the film. When I mentioned it would act out wonderfully as a play, I think it's really important to mention that they rehearsed like they would be rehearsing for a play. You know, they would rehearse Act 1 and then shoot, go away, rehearse for Act 2, etc, etc. And doing this created something charming that I haven't seen in film for such a long time. And that is simply natural acting. All the performances are fantastic, but Michael Fassbender's performance as Steve Jobs is just electrifying. When I was waiting for the red carpet footage to start for the LFF premiere, it was playing the soundtrack. And I'll be honest, it was a little bit annoying. But when the film actually started, something magical happened when putting the music against a beautiful script, talented actors and realistic sets, Steve Jobs was certainly playing the orchestra. <laughs> now this is nothing on the film itself, the direction or the script, but it's just not possible to do Steve Jobs in one movie. He deserves a trilogy. <laughs> I could have watched two more hours of this film and still could have been happy and entertained. Cannot wait to watch this film again in a silent room so I can appreciate every image and sound. Script writers, filmmakers and actors, take note because this is how it should be done. Thanks for watching, be sure to subscribe, like the video and leave a comment in the box below. Does Steve Jobs sit in your top 10 like it does in mine? And if you want to watch more 2015 reviews, just click on the links here. <laughs>